Hello there, Dr. Phil here. Um, I'm just over in, I'm not going to tell you exactly where I am, I'm in Newcastle somewhere. And in case you're interested, this is an area of Sydney, but basically that's an area where the, the crust has kind of moved upwards. Like Sydney is actually in a basin, there's a bit of a bowl, and at the edges of the bowl is where Newcastle is. And so what that means is that some of the really deep um, crust has actually made it to the surface. So things like coal and whatever else makes it to the surface at the Newcastle region. So that means it makes it pretty easy to figure out um, the age of the rocks around here. Usually they're carboniferous. And so that means there's also a good chance of getting some fossils. I've just found this piece of um, sandstone slash um, shale, basically. And I reckon it'd be pretty easy to crack it open. And we'll see what we can find. Let's have a look. Not much there. Try again. As you can see, I'm using advanced scientific methods here. Uh, I think they're roots, and I think they're more modern than what we're after. Although, no, maybe not. Yeah, unless... I'm not exactly the most amazing paleontologist out there, so... <laughs> as a matter of fact, not at all. So, unless somebody else can tell me that there's something good here, I don't think we found anything. What do you reckon? Soil scientist in me says that's a sign of drainage. <laughs> that yellow... Um, Iron oxide is very mobile, but you know that doesn't say anything about fossils. But this is interesting. It's a piece of sandstone, and it's got carbon staining all through it. I'm not going to be able to crack this open here, I don't think. But um, I'll take that home later. Doctor Phil out.